What's good, YouTube? Let's get this money. Y'all already know we getting money and eating honey. Game stock. This stock everybody talking about. Let's talk about it. Let's go straight to this to this one minute chart. Now it ain't too many technicals we could look at, but it's one pattern that I noticed last week what been happening with this stock. Now this this January 27th. And y'all see pre-market, pre-out, like before the market open, it always go up. And then it'll sell off at the beginning, like right at the beginning of the market open. Y'all see that on with the 27th? Y'all see that? And then let's go to the 28th. It did the same thing right, right at the beginning. Pre-market, it went up. And then it dropped down, then it sold off. Same thing. The 28th did the same thing. Pre-market up, then it sold off. I wanted to show y'all that little pattern right there. But should you buy the stock? That's the question of the video. Should you buy GameStop? If you got money that you don't care about, money that you're willing to lose, and then you feel like GameStop go go up and you got faith in this, and you behind what's going on, and you want to go against the hedge funds, and you think that GameStop go go up, go ahead. Put some money in there. But just know what risk you come that come with it. Like you gambling, and you you should know if you gambling, you should be willing to lose and be ready to lose your money, cause that's what you're doing. This stock could go up to five hundred dollars just as quick as it could go down to one hundred dollars. Just know the risk that you're taking with it. But if this your first time investing, and you ain't like you just now hearing about what's going on with Game Stock and AMC and these other stocks. And I suggest you invest in safer companies, more established companies, for real, because this ain't the way you want to start off investing. This not investing in this. This trying to get rich quick. And a lot of people go lose money in this. A lot of people go win some money. But this this a get rich quick. This what people trying to do, trying to get rich quick. And y'all, I know y'all didn't already heard about get rich quick schemes. They don't usually turn out good. So yeah, man. It's all about your risk tolerance, and you shouldn't be betting your your car note, your rent note. You shouldn't be putting your rent in the stock market in the game stock. If you need that money, that should be throwaway money, money that you don't need, money that if you lose it, you will still be all right without it. But I do feel like GameStop do got a chance to still run up a lot more, only if Robinhood don't make it where it's limited to the amount of shares that you could buy, because they. They sent out the message on Thursday and it said that starting tomorrow, which they were saying was going to be Friday, we plan to allow limited buys of the securities and will continue to monitor the situation and may make adjustments as needed. So they were saying, like I seen people posting in groups and stuff saying that they couldn't buy more than five shares. So it was like they limiting it. To the amount that we could run this stock up for real but if they cancel that where you could buy as many shares as you want to then i feel like this stock can run up a lot more but i'm staying away from it i might put a little something in there if i might it just it just got it just depend on how i'm feeling but it ain't gonna be a lot because i'm cool i ain't trying to hey i'm good but hey that's all i got for this video like the video subscribe Share the video to who you think it could help. Comment what y'all think. Comment what y'all want next. I'm gone.